And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. I'm delighted to say we have live Superliga action to bring you coming up. It's Olborg facing FC Copenhagen. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. The initial 11 today for the hosts. Well, on paper, it looks a fairly cautious approach because unless their wing-backs can get into more advanced areas, I'm not sure where the attacking width will come from. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And so the battle commences. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Great challenge, he got nothing but ball. He cuts it back. Well, he couldn't quite hit the target, Stuart. Well, it's a decent effort, but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. Will he play it in? Taylanda, promising attack this. Promising possession this. And dealt with that ball comfortably. Christiansen, Falk, and the pass not quite accurate enough, and a throw in then, Fossum, The attack continues, they're making considerable progress. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. Well, the referee not messing about, he's cautioned him. Well, it had to be a yellow card, and he knew it was coming. Played in there. In it goes! The goal for 1-0, and that changes the dynamic.
Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Are back underway and 1-0 it is let's see what happens next good physical play perfectly positioned to take it away either fossil And that's destined to run all the way through to the keeper. Nikolai Boylison. Jonas Vint. Keeping the ball moving. Laid into the box. Defended well. Making sure nothing untoward happened. And options in the centre. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. They're really pressing their opponents. A move of promise on the flank. They really look after... Spectacular save! Top-class goalkeeping! <laughs> and over comes the corner. Well, it had a chance, but the crossbar getting in the way. Well, he's certainly a threat in the air, but he just couldn't keep it down. Kevin Dix. Jonas Vint. And dispossessed. Fossum. Chance to cross. Jonas Vint. Now can they counter clinically? A delivery towards the back post. But it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it was played over. Well, very close to half-time now, and it's a narrow lead for the home side. Stuart, how would you assess what you've seen? Yes, they've defended really well all over the pitch. Their work rate and discipline has been excellent. But any drop in tempo and this lead could easily slip away. Jens Stage. No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. So the ball is rolling again at 1-0. 
Well, if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. And with that, the first half draws to a close. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, it was a vital goal and at a crucial time, you have to say. Certainly changes the complexion of the game now, but it's whether they can take the momentum into the second half as they've struggled at times today. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Biel. And players waiting in the centre. Oh, he's given it away. Either Fossil. And snuffing out the danger. Pepiel. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Well, they've given him too much space. Jens Stage. Well, possibilities inside the box. Stage. Well, space if he goes inside. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Falk. Well, the ball lost here. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, an example of a counter-attack that went nowhere. Jonas Vint. Petbiel. Firing it in, body on the line. Thirty minutes to go then. As clean as a whistle, that challenge. Extremely sloppy in possession. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. And he takes on the shot. Brilliant save. Jonas Vint. And he read it well. Well, he likes to run at them. And a long way out. Well, the teams are locked together. Will it stay that way following this corner? Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. Who's going to get on the end of it? Any goalkeeper would accept corner kick deliveries like that every day. Le Rager. Jonas Vint. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Ivo Fossu. Can they get in behind them? Magnificent defending. No problems for the keeper. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Well, just listen to this noise. How could you not be inspired by that? Fluency of movement. And the ball with Christensen. 
Opportunity to deliver the cross. It comes to absolutely nothing. Le Raga. Pepiel. Jonas Vint. Falk. Slipshod passing. Five minutes of the 90 still to go. And the teams cannot be separated. Christiansen. Singh. Rasmus Falk Jensen on the ball. Well, the pass not finding its target. And they push ahead on the closing stages. Gets it a go! The crossbar got in the way! And the ruling is offside here. have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game and there's the referee's whistle these two sides cannot be separated